In the next set of videos, I will show you how to derive the optimal hedge ratio. But before we can derive the optimal hedge ratio, I need to introduce you to the notion of basis risk. And basis risk is nothing more than the difference between the spot price and the futures price. So let's let's give an example to to verify this. So if we have here a contract that lasts for for instance four months, so four months, and we have here the futures price the current futures price, the starting futures price, F1, and this futures price will vary to the future. So actually it will decrease in the future and will decrease to some value F2. And in the same way, I will have the spot price, which will start more or less, let's put it near the futures, F1, and this Oops, F1, no, S1. So, S1. And this spot price, so remember that the spot price is the market price. So, S1 represents the market price at the moment, the current market price. And this current in this market price can also experience, will also experience price changes. And let's say that it, it will not have such a big volatility in this example. Let's Let's put it more or less like this. So this will be our S2. So our market price at the end of the four months. And the notion of basis risk is nothing more than the risk associated between the differences in these prices. So how far away or close these prices move. So this is the basis risk. And we also learn how to compute the effective price associated in this strategy. So remember that, so let's write here, the effective, effective price. So the effective price is nothing more than the price at which a commodity is sold or bought after the hedge has been ta been taken. So, and the formula that we learned for this is nothing more than the spot price, the market price at expiration at the end of the four months, minus the difference between the futures price, the change in the futures price, to be more precise. So this is our notion of effective price, and this is basically the only thing that you need to know in order to derive the optimal hedge ratio.